Hi everyone, today I am going to show you how to make these knotted bow versions using bias ribbon and this has all been provided by the lovely Donna of Pixiebot.supplies So look at this pink one I've got a blue one and I'm going to be using this blue version today and this is how they tend to turn out Now as I've mentioned before I do have learning challenges and one of those is dyspraxia so this is quite literally the only version of this style that I can make and what I do is I take the ribbon and hold it between my thumb and my finger open those two fingers up a little bit and then you bring that round like so go through there completely and then over so through there over and then you pull that through so through there so round the two through over and then you bring that through and up like so and then you pull until you've got a nice Just get my focus back. There we go. Sorry, the print made the camera go a bit crazy. And that's what you get. And then what I do is I take them up to there. And I, I am going to waste some ribbon now. Apologies. Take that to that side. And I'm going to twist this round because. Uh, want that at the front and again same thing a little bit over cut down at that angle just adjust my loops so, so that they all sit how I want them there you go and that is what you get now to add your clip what I do is I take it and you can sort of drop it on the side. There's always a side that you can sort of thread it through. It always takes me a minute, so apologies. Right, it can be a minute. Nope. There we go. So what you do is like I said, you wiggle that through the knot. And what I do to make sure it stays completely one hundred percent secure is lift that completely up that side and add a blob of glue that side. Impress and exactly the same that side because it's sort of in the actual knot. There you go. And then you press that nice and firm that side. And obviously we've cut the fray glue that we had earlier off because I thought I had measured a bit. Now I will say this, when you're cutting this, um, like I said from a tutorial, I've cut it down a little bit. If you're cutting it yourself, Sorry, I've got out of focus again. There we go. If you are cutting it for yourself, keep it on your sort of roll or something like that and sort of wrap it as you're going because um, you won't need as much as I just cut there as you saw from the little bit of waste. Um, it's easier to do it that way. It's just harder to show on camera and you're less likely to sort of waste material. 
There you go. So just those dots just there, just to seal that. Stop that frame. And there you go. That is your cute bias version. And I haven't got a nylon headband today, so I've made myself a, like a little elastic one. And I'll just show you the exact same thing again. Hopefully the camera will stay in focus this time. So hold it there. Wrap round the fingers, those two. Down, round, and up. Through that loop. So we used a short bit of ribbon this time. Okay, nice tight knot. Just balance out the sides. Just gonna even that up a little bit. Okay. And I'll just work out which side is the Trying to okay, that's better. So, what we will do is twist that round and I'll glue that in just a second. There you go again, tidy them up, and this method does work on other materials. I've got a um, velvet one just out of shot. I'll show you that. And hopefully, start despite my rubbish attempts to attach that to a headband in this. Some of you have found found this useful, and now know a different way to tie. That you might not have known before. Okay. Let's now help some, some more of you. Sorry, I went quiet there while I was concentrating. Apologies. Like I said, as you saw there, it does take a minute to manipulate that clip through the back of the bow. And as I was saying, this is a velvet. one that I've done. Like I said, it's equally as cute in that, in a slightly bigger version. So thank you for watching. Hopefully, like I said, as you said, you found this useful. Apologies for not being able to show you how to attach it to a headband, but like I said, you can have a giggle at my expense and I'll speak to you all soon. Thanks, bye!